So one of the most popular non-English destinations for studying medicine is Germany. So in this video, we are going to be covering studying medicine in Germany, how to get admission into German universities, cost of studying in Germany, and working in Germany as a doctor. German public universities offer perhaps the best quality of education in the world completely for free. So the first thing to note about medicine in Germany is that it's not divided into bachelor's and master's, but it's a one degree program that takes six years to complete. And it is very important to know that medicine in Germany is taught completely in German language. So you need a very strong knowledge of German to be able to study medicine in Germany. But don't be alarmed if you can't speak German because some universities offer a one-year preparatory course that teaches students that have no knowledge of German language on how to speak German. Okay, so general medicine in Germany takes about six years, three months to complete and it ends with the state licensing medical examination. Pazli, Che, Prufung. So general medicine in Germany is divided into three major stages. Stage one. The first stage is the preclinical stage. This is where you are taught the basis of medicine like anatomy, physiology, and other subjects. Stage two. The second stage is the clinical phase. This is the stage where you get deeper into medicine and you get to learn other subjects like pharmacology and general surgery. Stage three. So the third stage is the practical stage. This is when you begin your practicals and you are taught all about practicing medicine as a doctor. And after you have completed your six years as a student, you are eligible to take the state licensing examination, which allows allows you to practice as a doctor in Germany. Number one, subscribe to my channel. Number two, like we said before, to get admission into the German universities, you have to be able to have a strong knowledge of the German language. Why? Because all the degrees are taught in German. To do this, you have to pass the test DAF to prove your proficiency in German language. Number three, so if you are from an EU country, your high school certificate is automatically accepted, but if not, you have to check on the official website if your certificate is accepted by German universities. If not, you have to sit for a compulsory one-year preparatory course and after that, sit for the German high school examination. Number four, ability to cope under strength because students have to sit for about 25 to 30 hours of compulsory classes Everything. It's a good idea to contact the admission office of your university one year beforehand because this gives you an edge over other students. You just simply need to visit your university's website. The documents required are your international passport and your high school certificate. You create an account, you apply for admission and you monitor your admission on the website. You also need to be in contact with an admission officer from your university because this gives you specific information about your university's application requirements. If you are studying medicine in a public university in Germany, the cost of study is completely for free, although you may need to pay 250 euros of administrative fees every semester. So German universities usually don't offer hostel accommodations, so our students have to find their private accommodations in an apartment or a flat. This incurs a major living cost on students in Germany. Students spend about $400 a month on rent and $200 on food every month. The good thing is that students are allowed to work which allows them to earn money which covers some of their expenses. There is a high demand on the German labor market for doctors, which makes it easier for doctors to migrate to Germany and have high paying jobs. Remember, to work in Germany, you have to have a high knowledge of German because you're working in a place full of German people. They will speak German. And also, you have to pass the medical license examination. Please subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to subscribe because that motivates us to make more videos. And uh, we got all the information in this video from topuniversities.com. The link is going to be in the description. Don't forget to subscribe and leave a like. And also give us a comment if you'd like to study in Germany. Thank you and see you next time.